to my channel my name is Ashley if you are new and if you are not new hey girl thank you for coming back so today's video is going to be a small business video so um let's just get it going today is Sunday August 27th and if you watched um any of like my other posts y'all know that I recently moved and so I haven't been active on any of my business accounts in like a week and a half just because of moving and you know the move was sudden like well I knew I was moving but I ended up moving a week before I planned to move so um yeah I just it's been a week and a half since I've posted to date um so it's time to get back to it like we're getting back in the swing of things I want to start posting this week um also possibly even today um and well I probably won't even be able to post today just to be honest but I want to start posting this week for sure and so I just finished um planning all of the posts for the week so let me show you Y'all know I use um, OneNote to like plan my post. So I kind of like planned out some emails and stuff. Um, I wanted to send an email today and I still might try to like create one real quick. Um, and then obviously I'm going to be making some TikToks and then posting those same TikToks over on Instagram um, and on Pinterest. Um, and yeah. Anyways, so I just feel like my TikTok has kind of been stagnant and downhill. Like I've been growing, but like very, very slowly. And so it's just trying to switch things up. Um, I've been like posting the same type of videos, same type of videos and like, you know, getting not that much engagement, not that much views. And honestly, I don't care that much about engagement. All I care about, you don't have to like my post. You don't have to comment. You don't have to share. Obviously, I would like if you did that, but you don't have to. I just want you to buy. If you would say if the choice was for you to like my post versus buy something i'd rather you just go and buy it you know what i mean um but what i do care about is the reach and so i know like my reach isn't the best with all of my videos they don't seem to be reaching that many people so it's time to just switch things up so i want to just start talking more and be more like informative instead of so salesy even though i feel like you know the posts that i've been doing haven't been too too salesy like most of my tiktok posts are just like styling videos how to style my products and the order to say like wardrobe essentials so i feel like i'm you know selling it in a different type of way versus just saying buy this but i just you know you always need to be trying new things so if one thing isn't working or if you feel like it's not working to the best of your ability or it just it's hit a plateau it's time to try something different trying to switch things up and i've wanted to do more informative styling type of videos but i just kind of always made excuses in my last place because there was never anywhere where i could film and yada 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 i didn't like my hair just making excuses and so you know i told myself if as you if you watch my last videos then you know like i told myself that i'm in this new space like i'm elevating i'm no more excuses like there's no excuses this is a beautiful home it's so clean it has everything has a spot so there's not a ton of stuff everywhere like how in my last place like you know there was stuff everywhere because it was a one bedroom and we had just grown out of it this is a new space everything has a spot you, there's plenty of empty wall space for me to film sorry if y'all hear noise it's the um oh it just went off it's the refrigerator like the refrigerator is so fucking loud um but anyways there's no excuse for me not to do the shit that i need to do so we're about to just make it happen so i planned out i watched some tiktoks of some different like fall videos and just in general and i planned out some tiktoks um that i'm going to do like some talking ones so i want to do a mix of talking and just like the normal styling and all of that stuff just so it's like more variety and just try to get people to follow i feel like more people will follow if they feel like I'm giving tips or if I can start like a series like I want to do a series where it's like affordable what is it where to find affordable basics and how to style them um because basically that's what I sell is affordable wardrobe essentials and so I want to do like where to find um well, I'm going to title it like where to find affordable basics and how to style them but obviously I'm telling you to buy from me so instead of just saying oh buy this top I'm just going to make it seem as though it's not me selling it even though it's me selling it you know what i'm saying like you know um because i see a lot of people do stuff like that for amazon or you know all of this stuff so i want to do that for my business as well and i feel like it would be a great way to engage people if i make it some if i make it like a series it would be a good way to get people to uh subscribe or not subscribe but to follow because they want to see like the different parts um and all of that stuff um so yeah 
so i plan to do i want to do one every day or not necessarily a different part of the series every day but at least one talking video every day this week did i plan one every day yeah i planned one every day for monday through saturday um i don't have any videos planned for today just because like i'm trying to do all this prepping for the week today so that's why i said i'm not 100 percent sure if i'm gonna be able to film today or post today but um i plan i planned a talking video for one every day and then the other videos will be just like you know other types of non-talking so just music playing or whatever whatever and i know tiktok also does prefer like original content and you know it's like tiktok is different like it's always evolving it's not the same as when we first got on tiktok when it was all about just the trending sounds dancing and da 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 like now it's more so about personality like people want to follow you for you like it's not so much of having all of the trending audios you know what i mean like obviously you still want to use some of the trending audios do some of the trends or whatever if it fits but that's not what it's all about and so i feel like even me when i do videos where it's me talking versus a sound it does better than when i do the sound sometimes and so i want to do more videos of me talking and all of that stuff and so um yeah so i feel like i've been rambling a lot like i always freaking ramble i need to just start my videos and start them going instead of talking for a gazillion hours so i'm about to do my makeup and then i'm going to start filming the videos i'm gonna prop y'all up so y'all can kind of see them and i will show y'all some of the stuff that i am um about to be showing so if you guys are looking for affordable basics obviously you can just click out of the video and go straight to the website or you can stick around and watch the video and then go to the website. Um, no, but I will show you guys the pieces that I'm going to be talking about um, in the different videos. And then obviously y'all will see the behind the scenes. Alrighty guys, so it's a little bit later. I ended up doing my nails. As you can see, I just did some um, friendship press-ons. And then I did do my makeup. I tried to just do like a light beat. I don't want to look like too dolled up because i wanted to give like just effortless every day like i'm cute so i just put a little bit of concealer underneath my eyes and then just the littlest like literally one half a drop of foundation and made that work for the rest of my face mainly just my cheeks and like you know so anyways wanted to go super light with the makeup no eyeliner no eyeshadow like just effortless um and then for the outfit i have on this black bodysuit this bodysuit is um from the style district um this bodysuit i love this bodysuit it is a high neck bodysuit i love high neck because i just feel like high neck just gives elevated it just gives like like it just gives elevated it makes it look look it makes anything look dressed up without dressing up and then i just have on these shorts these shorts are from rainbow i bought these a while ago um and i actually never wore them but these are just like some cargo style shorts these are actually really cute i'm like i need to get some of these for the store um maybe next year but just some shorts you're not really even going to see the bottoms but obviously i wanted to have on some bottoms mainly you just see like the top and maybe just a little bit of the bottom um but i wanted to make sure obviously i was wearing something from the style district um so yeah this is one of our bodysuits also if you guys are looking for a bodysuit then check this one out i know the sizing is a little may kind of throw people off because it's a small medium and then medium large so you might think of that like what like i don't know why they size it that way like i would say it's more of a small medium large extra large because i'm an extra large and i'm wearing the medium large and like it fits snug like it's gonna fit to you but i still have like all of this room like this bodysuit is super duper stretchy um so if you you know hold on so if you've watched any of my other videos and i talked about the bodysuit and maybe you thought like oh no the medium large won't fit me like it's gonna fit like i feel like like i said i'm a extra large 1x depending on what it is for right now but by the end of the year i'll be a medium okay but anyway right now i'm an extra large slash 1x and i fit into this perfectly so i would say it would go up to like a 1x maybe even a 2x um, with the large extra large just because it's so freaking stretchy and like i said it's comfortable it's high neck um it's like ribs comes in four colors have i'm just showing you because it's literally right here um it has pink comes in blue also comes in white and then obviously the black so and it's only twenty dollars um but if you use code i forget what my code is i'll put it on the screen i have a code for my youtube subbies where you can get i believe it's like 15 percent off so yes thank you for that was sponsored by the establishment no i'm just kidding um 
But yeah, so I'm about to just film. I think I'm going to do it right here because I feel like the lighting looks um, looks good right here. And like I said, you can see the TV in the background and all of that. But that's the kind of vibe I kind of want to give. Like, I don't want it to look too, like, studio. Um, like I said, I'm trying to do something different with the content. And so I just want it to be just like, oh, I'm just chilling, just telling y'all about some of my favorite products. They just so happen to be for my store. So shop, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want it to give, like, super studio, super fancy super aesthetic like just regular degular so you can see the tv in the background as long as the background is clean and the lighting is good that's all that matter i do kind of hate that it's so much of a glare on my glasses so hopefully that's not too distracting but there's nothing i can do about it and i don't really i don't want to sorry i got that close but i can't see without them i don't want to not wear glasses because i don't know i don't really like how i look without glasses i kind of go through phases where i hate how i look with glasses so i'll go wear contact for a year straight and then i go through a phase where i hate what i look like without glasses so i only wear my glasses and i'm currently in that phase where i don't like really how i look without glasses so i only wear glasses like i don't even have a pair of contacts to wear if i wanted to so um like I could film the video without my glasses so that way I don't have a glare but I don't know I just I really like my glasses so I'm going to clean them off though because they are dirty even though y'all can't tell they're dirty just because of the glare um and then next time I get glasses I'm for sure going to get the anti-glare so that way they don't do this um but yeah I'm going to stop rambling now um I just wanted to show y'all what I was wearing and I'm going to prop y'all up so y'all can kind of see the behind the scenes of me making these TikToks only been a few hours, but it felt like days. Only been days, but it felt like months. Gone for a year, only been like months. Life moves fast when you know what you want. Like, I literally only filmed two TikToks, and I swore I was going to be done filming the TikToks by four. No. Like, and I'm just tired. I, I don't know. I'm just, like, tired. Like, like I have a headache. Like, I just want to just lay down and think about nothing. Like, my brain is, like, fried. Like, I just want to rip my fucking head off. But, so I'm just going to just figure something out for, like, the other TikToks uh, for this week that, like, I wanted to film. Um, and just post some other stuff. I might only be able to post once a week. I was trying to aim for two to three times a week or two to three times a day. And I might only be able to do once a day, which is okay because not everybody posts a gazillion times a day. Like some people only post once a day. Um, like one, maybe I can get back, work my way back up to posting three times a day. But for now, once, at least posting once, maybe even twice will be fine, I feel like. So um yeah also um so yeah i'm about to just <laughs> I, I just feel like i'm delirious so i'm gonna stop rambling i probably will come talk to y'all later if i do any other like business stuff later right now i'm about to just um probably film a different video like a september uh september reset video and then relax for a little bit i still need to cook dinner i still need to go to my old house like i have so much i need to do today so i feel like that's another reason why like like, I just have anxiety, so I feel like it's just anxiety and not, like, can't do anything about it. So, that's all for now. I will talk to y'all a little bit later. Hey, guys. So, it's later. It's 731, and I'm just going to end off the night by packaging up this order. I am exhausted, y'all, but I want to get this. <coughs> excuse me. I want to get this order packaged. Our girl April ordered two of our best-selling jumps or rumpers um so here we go this is our mineral raw seamless rumper she ordered it in black as you can see it has a little detail across the waist to give you some shape and then on in the back the back is um cut out and it also has detailing on the sides and she ordered it in black as well as in navy so shout out to our girl april thank you for ordering 
Um, so yeah, um, I'm just gonna package this up for her. I actually think I only have in the black one more large, extra large left. And then um, in the blue, I have two more um, of the small medium left. So if you guys were interested in this um, in this uh, romper, then head on to the site because we are very, very low stock and I will not be restocking. Actually, the vendor just um, restocked it. Um, the vendor just restocked this bodysuit. Sorry, I'm trying to figure out a good way to fold it. I suck when it comes to folding these clothes. The vendor just restocked this romper, but I don't want to, I don't want to restock it on the site just because I feel like summertime's about to be over, but then I'm still kind of tempted, like, should I just buy more? Um, I don't know if they have the colors available too that I purchased to be able to like just restock the same colors or if it's different colors. Um, I know they have different colors. Um, like if they have, for the other colors, like I wouldn't get that because I don't have to have a whole photo shoot and that's just a lot. But if they had these two colors, I could just get it and restock these two colors. But I'm really hoping that the vendor um, sells this again next year so I can bring it back next, uh, next summer and get more colors because I thought about getting more colors. But I'm like, no, let me just get two. Um, and then they ended up selling really well. So happy about that. And I think the photo shoot too, like, helped sell them really well. Like, I, again, the photos were more lifestyle photos and all of that stuff. Y'all can't even see. But, yeah, so these two are going to go in the bag. I only have one more, like, personalized bag left too. Um, or, like, one more bag that has, like, my logo. I don't think I'm going to get any more. I think I'm just going to, like I have some um, black bags, so just use those ones and then maybe buy some cute pink bags from, um, maybe buy some cute pink bags from Amazon or something, like, I don't know. So we'll see, we'll see. So... Yeah, so here is my girl's order. I must have just print out her packing slip. And then we are going to call it a night. So I probably will see y'all maybe tomorrow or, you know, probably tomorrow. Whenever I'm doing some more business stuff, I will pick y'all back up. Hey, guys. So um, hopefully it's not like lines. I have the silicone on. Sometimes it makes like lines on the video and hopefully you guys can hear me because i also have the fan going um but i'll try to talk loud but today is monday august 28th it is 8 21 p.m and i am just now sitting down to start working on stuff for the store um today is monday and tomorrow i want to do 20 dollars dresses so it's going to be a t like a 20 dollar tuesday type thing um all dresses are going to be $20 um, for just Tuesday. And I also want to try to go live tomorrow as well um, to promote the $20 Tuesday. So I'm just right now getting everything ready. I have two emails that are um, ready to go. Or I'm going to show you what they look like. But I'm um, pretty much going to just schedule them to get ready. To schedule them to go. Well, they were already scheduled, but I edited them. But anyways. Two emails that's going to go out one at 10 a.m and then another one at 7 p.m like just the last chance and i'm also going to send out a text message um tomorrow um for the 20 dollars tuesday or whatever and then yeah like obviously i'm going to promote on all of my socials and i need to change the website but i will change the website in the morning um and so yeah so let me just show you guys um or i might change the website and all that stuff tonight like because nobody's really i mean if they shop to get the 20 dollars just tonight like that's fine too but um so yeah let me just um i should send an email at midnight too hmm. but anyways let me show you the email 
So here is the email. I've used this template before back when I had dresses 20% off. So it's the same template that I've sent out before. So if I just changed it to $20 today only and then it has the everyday midi dress. So the two midi dresses and then the casual mini dress. So the mini dresses and then shop all dresses. So this is going to be the first email that goes out at 10 a.m. And here is the second email that's going to go out. Um, this one is going to go out at 7 p.m. Again, I've used kind of like a similar, like I've used this picture in emails before. So it's just like, you know, every email don't have to be like super fresh. You can, you know, revamp, resend old emails, you know, whatever. But anyway, so it just says easy throw on and go outfit. Perfect for all your plans. I um, mean, used to say perfect for all your summer plans. But since summer is like about to be over, which is why I'm having the dresses on sale. I just said perfect for all your plans. And then just highlighting um, the dress. So this is our mini dress. It's ribbed. It has a collar. Um, and then here are the other two colors of the dress. And then this is our midi dress, it's ribs, square neck, front slit, and then the two dresses, and then she says shop $20 dresses. So this is the email that's gonna go out at 7 p.m., just kind of like a last chance to get the dresses for $20 today only. So yeah, I'm happy that the emails are ready. So the last things that I need to do to prepare for the $20 Tuesday is just schedule a text message, um, change the website header just to like the dresses, and then um, like make sure that I have like my social media posts and stuff like ready for tomorrow, like have some TikToks. I'm gonna try to post at least four TikToks tomorrow um, throughout the day. And um, yeah, so I'm about to just spend the rest of the night doing that to just prepare for tomorrow. And then like I said, I do wanna try to go live tomorrow. Um, I need to go live tomorrow just to try to promote the sale, $20 Tuesday, I haven't went live in a while. So, and like y'all know, I haven't even really been that active on my TikTok in a while. So, um, just to kind of promote the sale, $20 Tuesday, my goal is to sell, like, four dresses. Like, I'm going to say two. That's, like, my realistic goal is to sell at least two. But I would like it if I could sell, like, four or five, like, to make a quick $100. Like, that would be amazing. Um, but at the time of this video, obviously, the $20 Tuesday is, off, is over. So, if you guys um, are watching this video and you guys are interested in the type of clothing that I sell, Chic Wardrobe Essentials, make sure you guys join our email list and join our text list so you guys can keep up with the sales because obviously the video is filmed in real time and so it goes up after whenever I have like flash sales or stuff like that. So yeah, just um, make sure that you guys are on our email list or on our text list so you guys can know. I will uh, put the number on the screen so you can sign up for the text list. Um, and then there's a link in the description box where you can it'll take you to a landing page where you can sign up for our email list so that way you can know about all of our deals and all of that as well as there is a special code for my YouTube subscribers to get 15% off your orders. You could also use that code to like save some money if you guys want to shop um, or you know somebody you know that wants to shop or whatever. But yeah, so I'm about to just keep working and I'll check in with y'all a little bit later. Okay, I just changed all the prices to $20, but I just want to let you guys know that I use this app called NA Bulk Price Editor. Um, and this is an app that I usually use if I'm trying to do like a bulk price change because um, you can schedule it to change the prices at a certain date. You can schedule it to re automatically revert the prices to a, a certain date. So it's just easier, especially if you're doing a bunch of different items to just use this app versus doing it manually. Um, and this app, it does have a free plan available. It has a 14-day trial. I originally used this app was it last year? It was either last year or the year before for Black Friday and I did it during the uh, free trial period. Um, so if you don't need it right now, think about it maybe for Black Friday. You might, you know, when you're changing your prices or whatever, you could just do it for the free trial. But like I said, they do have a free plan if you're not going to be doing changing prices that much, like 100 product variant price changes per month for free. So it's, you know, I don't use it that often like I honestly forgot about this I was about to change stuff by hand but I'm like you know what I don't feel like doing all that I know I got an app you know that can do it for free so 
if you're not going to be changing your products or you don't you have less than 100 variants that you want to change per month this is a free option or it's ten dollars a month if you are constantly having sales you want to just kind of flip back and forth um, between the prices easily and you have like a ton of you know different variants different products that you're changing um but as you can see it just this is kind of like what it like looks like this is the page on shopify so let me actually go to the thing so when you get here you would just do add new price job you can title it like whatever you want and then um you can just do like automatic rules if you want so you can change the price by a certain percentage so if you want to just make everything 10 percent off um, you can do that if you want to change the price by a certain amount you can take ten dollars off everything change the price to a certain amount which is what i did i changed the price everything to all the dresses to twenty dollars um you can just do so much and then you can change the compare at price you can choose like which products you want to do if you want to just do a certain collection like i said i just did the dresses collection on my site um, you can select individual products that you want to change if you only want to do like if you want to do a sale on certain products a different sale on certain products um, you can also you know like there's just so much that you can um, so much you can do and, and it does it automatically then like I said you can choose if you want to change the prices now if you want to change the prices later and then revert them back to the original prices at a later time so you can have this stuff like already scheduled so I just did it for right now and then I have it to revert back to the original prices at 11:59 tomorrow so it ends so the seller end tomorrow night because obviously I'm not about to stay up all night to do the sales um or to change the prices back and that way i don't have to like rush to do it in the morning so you can see like oh last time i used it was 2021 um you can see i did it around black friday which i was lowering the prices to 30 percent off 40 percent off and you know a bunch of other stuff that i did so just wanted to show you guys this app and just let you guys know if you guys are you know doing price bulk changes or do having sales like all the time and you have a lot of stuff you don't have to do it by hand you can use an a Shopify app alrighty guys so let me just show you the website quick so as you can see $20 dresses and then it just has all of the dresses so these are all of our dresses so if you were looking for a $20 dress you missed out if you, unless you want to email us um, so these are all of the dresses like I said I just went ahead and already just marked them down because i wanted to change the website tonight so i just said it'll just start today like if somebody shops tonight great if not everybody will get like my um people get texts and all that stuff tomorrow um so all the dresses are twenty dollars like i really would love to sell some of these because you know summertime is about to be over so i'm not going to be able to promote them as much until you know next year so i don't want to like carry it into next year especially these dresses like they need to go these ones too um so yes that's that and then what am i trying to okay here is the text message so the text message looks just like the website just is dresses twenty dollars today only and then the wording it just says twenty dollar tuesday all dresses twenty dollars today only no code needed don't wait grab your new thrown and go outfit today so yeah and then i'm trying to decide on what time i want to send it out because the text message like I use SMS bump for text messaging and they don't allow me to schedule per time zone so trying to find a good time to send it so I think I'm going to send it at 8 a.m pacific time because that's the time zone that I'm in is pacific time um but most of my customers are really like central and east coast so so to get to the central time at 10 and east coast around 11 which is fine i wanted it to be a little bit earlier but i feel like that's still pretty good and then i'll kind of decide if i want to send another email later on in the evening because y'all know i'm sending a second text so i have to see like what the website traffic is like if i want to send a second email or if i go live on tiktok or something like that and get sales if i want to send another uh not a second email because i'm sending a second email but if i want to send a second text message so this is what this is looking like so yeah that's pretty much it for the night i'm about to just create the social media content i don't know if i'm gonna come back and show y'all that or not um 
but yeah i feel like if i don't come and show y'all the social media content then i will just probably talk to y'all tomorrow um when i get home from work and i go live so yeah hey guys so the lighting sucks like i don't know why it's so dark well i know why it's dark but sorry i just wanted to come on here quickly to say that um Excuse me, today is Tuesday, so $20 Tuesday, and um, the $20 Tuesday was a success. We did get an order, so that's great. Um, we did get an order for one of our $20 dresses, so it's only $6.34, so we still have time to, you know, get some more orders. Like I said, I have emails still going out tonight, and um, Instagram posts and TikToks and stuff to still continue to post tonight. I did go live live was kind of a flop and honestly i was only on there for like 10 20 minutes because child i don't think live is for me but um i did go live so it's like i'm trying to do my due diligence as far as like promoting all of the different ways that i can i think i'm gonna post like a community post on my youtube um and yeah so that's pretty much all i'm not about to, I'm about to just chill and do a little bit of work for tonight um, I'm really, really tired, um, but yeah, that's pretty much it today. I might actually take, I don't know if I'm going to take today off. I feel like I should, um, because like I said, I'm really tired, so I kind of want to just shower and just go to sleep for tonight and just, you know, start fresh tomorrow and go ham tomorrow. Um, I did, you know, a bunch already today. I did a bunch last night, um. So yeah, I'm just going to chill for the rest of the night, but I just wanted to come in and update you guys on how $20 Tuesday went. Hey guys, so today is September 2nd. Ooh, excuse me. I just had a lot, sorry. I don't know when the last time I, excuse me, vlogged for this vlog. Um, I think it might have been Tuesday. Uh, I'm not sure. But anyways, today is Saturday, September 2nd, and I am off work, obviously because it's weekend, but it's like a Labor Day weekend, so I'm, I was off yesterday. And I'm also off Monday, so um, yesterday I didn't do too much. I did go to the Fashion District, <clears throat> which is exciting because that means that I have new arrivals coming this month. If y'all watched my September reset, I told y'all that I was I really wanted to drop new arrivals this month, but I wasn't 100% sure if I would be able to. But my dad helped your girl out per use. He always comes through. Uh, he's definitely like one of the biggest supporters slash investors for the Style District. So super like grateful for him um so i did get some stuff for new arrivals next for new arrivals i will be dropping this month but i did film like a whole fashion district video and me planning out new arrivals and all of that so be on the lookout for that video um right now i'm thinking of having i have my photo shoot scheduled as well my photo shoot is scheduled for the 17th um so i'm thinking of dropping the new arrivals the week after that i'm not sure what day that is um i think it's the 24th i'm not sure um but <clears throat> yes so since i'm going to be having new arrivals drop this month it's going to be a good exciting month i want to um really be on the ball when it comes to just you know promoting and all of that stuff also um the holidays are going to be you know right around the corner like after september it's just like october november like obviously we all know the months but um it's the holiday time so i definitely took that in consideration when i was buying new arrivals uh, getting things that can um you know go well with black friday sales and then like, i also know i already kind of planned out a <clears throat> winter type collection that i'm going to drop in the uh, november so i'm super excited um about you know everything um like i said um and yeah i'm just like excited um so the reason i came on here though besides telling y'all all of that is so i need to get on my shit when it comes to september uh well i actually feel like i've been doing really good like i'm like so proud of myself this year when it comes to my business i have been doing really really well i've been making sales every month consistently i've been you know i did the pop-up shops earlier in the year or over the summer um i did I've been consistent with my Pinterest, which has really been bringing in sales. And yeah, like I'm just really proud of myself. I've been dropping new collections every, um, this would be my fourth collection of the year, which is great because I told myself that I wanted to, I wanted to drop new arrivals every other month, but if I couldn't do that, then at least dropping new arrivals each season. So I had my spring collection, which actually was our best collection. I said our, the style district slash my, 
best collection that I've done like basically almost all of those pieces sold out or at least sold like everything from that collection which is like good sometimes um with collections I only sell like one or two things actually I didn't sell everything because I the, the seamless sets those have not sold like I have not sold one seamless set so yeah that's that's no bueno um but um I did I have been um doing good I did sell like those rumpers I will always tell y'all those sold really really well I think I only have like two left of the rumpers um the set sold really well the um looser set with the oversized tee and biker shorts I only have one left of that size extra large if anybody's watching this and you're looking for a set uh, um our two crop tank top set sold those sold really well and the good thing about the collection that's that collection is that i ordered from a vendor that typically has if i don't know if y'all can hear the, um the ice cream truck but there's the ice cream truck going by but i typically for most of that stuff i should be able to restock it next um next spring so i know for sure those tanks they typically the vendor i get it from have those tanks every year so i should be able to restock the black and the white as well as get new colors for next spring and and also the rumpers i'm hoping that they bring the rumpers back i believe this is their first year selling those rumpers so if they bring the rumpers back next year i'm definitely going to restock in the two colors that i already have and then possibly get another color <laughs> and then same thing with the biker short set they typically have that every year so i will restock the color that i already have as well as possibly getting a new color so that's good because that's kind of the direction that i want to take the style district in like i really want to sell y'all know we sell wardrobe essentials so i want to um and also with that i want to sell stuff that i can restock every, like you know continuously restock like i hate every time having to think of new stuff to get like i hate like oh what do i want to get you know like it would be easier for me if i knew i could just restock it because i know this is selling well i know how to sell it and people are looking for this so if i could just consistently restock stuff and keep stuff in stock that's selling versus always thinking of something new to sell and then having to figure out how can i market it to make people want to buy it from me versus buying it from somewhere else um so yeah, super, super excited for the spring because I know I'm going to be able to restock a bunch of stuff and all of that stuff should, you know, continue to still sell well and I'll be able to still use the same content that I already have so I don't have to, you know, redo a whole nother photo shoot and all of that stuff. Like I can just do photo shoots with the new, the newer colors. But anyways, so <clears throat> on my shit for September, just like I be on my shit every month. So I kind of wrote out, y'all probably can't see, but I kind of just wrote out my revenue goal and then just each week kind of just like a summary of how i plan to achieve it each week so like what i want to focus on any promotions that i'm going to sell any promotions that i'm going to have to help me reach my goal for that week and so yeah so i'm doing that so i'm about to use my whiteboard um i haven't used my whiteboard in forever and i really want to like have it on my whiteboard because i typically will y'all know y'all see me doing it in one note I plan out my weeks in one note, but I really want to have it up on the board. So when I'm sitting at my desk, I'm constantly looking at it every day. I need to, I can see this is the goal. This is what I'm working towards um, without having to log on to the computer to see that. So I must have just transfer what was on this sheet onto this whiteboard. And then I'm not, I want to hang this whiteboard up so it could just be hung up, but I'm not about to do that right now because I need to get like the clips or whatever to be able to hang this up. I wish it like I could, um, command it to the wall but i'm not i can't do that um so yeah um but anyways i've been rambling for seven minutes so let's get to right now our goal back outside boys tone the 70 on the strip i'm ready to die Cutting the tracks, you been in the corner, then I make shit glide. Try to bring the drive, tell me he ain't know how we cha cha slide. I'll never lose sleep over no bitch, way too much pride. Fill it up in a briefcase, make the shit with the vibes. Breaking them brinks, truck, my right wrist, bang, teeth. I spent days in the east, trying to figure if I'm geek. This bitch tweaking, talk too much while I was geek. Do my peak, fucking rap, niggas hoes, I'm on the street. Alrighty guys, so it's actually been a couple of hours um, since I like, you know, worked on my um, 
board. So this is what it's looking like. I have each week laid out as well as what the goal for the week is. Um, the emails that I want to send, text messages I want to send. So this is mainly for the style chick. I thought about after I finished, like, dang, I should have added, like, my YouTube videos that I want to post for the week and just all of that. But I didn't feel like erasing it and rewriting it. So I might do that later. But um, for now, I just have, it's just the style district stuff up there. And then I have a to-do list for the style district. Um, just kind of like weekly to-do list as far as like creating content, scheduling emails, scheduling the text. And then I have like some blog posts that I want to create for the month of September. Um, and then I am going to make like a checklist for the new arrivals prep. So that way this can just be up and, you know, ready. But I want to take a break from this because I need to start prepping for the week. I need to start um, prepping for the week. So, um... I want to do or I'm going to do seamless sets are going to be $15 this week only so the, by, this video is going to be up this week that the, that the sale is going on so if you guys are looking for a seamless set check out our website because they will be $15 no code needed um, I have two of them one in nude and one in black and I think I told you earlier that those I have not sold not a single seamless set which is like crazy um, our other sets usually typically set sell really well so I don't know why the seamless set has not been selling and so since summer is about to be over uh, we have about maybe like a month month and a half of it still being warm I'm like I need to get these sets out of here I don't want to carry them over into next year so let's try to sell as many as we can so my goal is to sell at least four sets this week um or for y'all it'd be this week but for me it's well it's tomorrow because tomorrow's sunday so sell four sets coming up this week um uh so i'm gonna mark them 50 percent off they're currently 30 dollars. i'm gonna mark them 50 percent off and make them um 15 dollars um and i honestly feel like they're not selling just because amazon is like Amazon just be killing it and or because they have everything so I feel like you know there's so many people that buy their seamless sets from Amazon so it's hard to compete with Amazon um, just because they have a ton of influencers ton of uh, affiliates like constantly promoting for them all the time and all I see is them promoting seamless stuff from them all the time so but we still finna work hard because we still want to I want to make some money too. Amazon can't take everything. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to um, be doing that. And so with that being said, I would like to create the content now because my problem is I'd be waiting to Sunday to create the content when it's like I need to be posting it Sunday. Like I need to have the content created today as in Saturday. So that way Sunday the week starts, I can already have it, you know, ready to go. So I created um, like a little sheets just quickly. I know I usually do this in one note and I probably will transfer it over in one note, but I was just trying to do it quickly because I want to be able to create the content while I while the sun is out. Um, and so this is just like some constant ideas for um, the seamless sets. Obviously, I'm going to be posting other stuff besides just the seamless sets, but for now, tonight i really want or today i just really want to focus on making sure i get all of the content i need for the seamless sets um created so that way i know for sure that's out the way and then any other content i excuse me i do in between is just you know i can do that tomorrow but i need the seamless set stuff to be ready so yes i'm actually kind of hot because i turned the fan off but i'm thinking of opening up these blinds so that way the sun oh, I knocked my tablet over. Oh no. My dad would be like, girl, if he's watching this, he's probably like shaking his head right now. But it wasn't my fault, dad. This is because I'm, I'm not to this thing. But, anyways, I'm thinking of opening up these blinds and then using this floor space. I feel like if I open these up all of the way, it kind of like gives. Well, it's kind of like glary. That's why sometimes it's like when you wait too long, it'd be like real shadowy. So I don't want it to be too shadowy. So I don't know. But I was thinking of, y'all know I just, I be needing some light because I prefer to do this stuff in sunlight versus um, artificial light. It just looks, it just hits better with sunlight. So um, yeah, I might try to use this, you know, right here to create the content. So I'm just going to prop y'all up. I'm just going to prop y'all up so y'all can kind of just see behind the scenes of me creating the content. Do it. 
guys so this is going to be like the last little bit of the vlog Ugh, sorry the lighting Ugh, is trash it's because oh the lighting is behind me i should have been ready before i started filming <laughs> but um i think yesterday i told y'all that the sets were gonna be um that the sets were gonna be on sale for fifteen dollars so they are um last night i think after i i think the last clip y'all saw was me um doing the like flat lays um for the seamless sets or trying to get some like um social media content and then after that i ended up working out making dinner and then I edited, spent the rest of the night editing my vlog. And then today I've been just tired. Like, I think it's because the last two days I've been like just up and at them. So today I was just really tired. So I woke up early, uh, went to the grocery store. But then I ended up eating Chipotle and K and I, like KO and like took a long ass, or not even a long nap, but just took a nap. So I didn't start working until about an hour and a half ago. Um, and I totally forgot that, duh, I'm having a sale. Like, girl, get your ass up. So normal me would have been like oh it's late i'll just start the sale tomorrow and i'll just do it but i was just like no girl it's three o'clock like granted it's three o'clock pacific meaning that it's whatever time eastern and that's where most of my customers are but still it's like people are settling in the house this is the time they're on the couch relaxing so they'll be checking their texts they'll be checking their emails and da 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 send that fucking text message send that email so that's what i did i changed the website to say that it was 15 dollars sets i sent a text message just saying it was 15 dollars sets and i just finished doing an email and i'm about to just show it to y'all real quick before i send it off so that's what i came out here to do so here's the email that's gonna go out today saying 15 dollars sets um so it's just gonna be uh it's just simple just seamless set only $15 then it just says this is not a drill our seamless sets are 50% off this week only this set is perfect for all the girls that love to be comfortable but still slay while running errands grabbing coffee or taking a spin class and then it just has the two sets and then again shop $15 sets so I'm gonna send this out right now um, the text message that I sent out let me see if I can view it uh, let's see show message oh well it says the same thing it's not going to show the graphic but SEMA sets only $15 this week only grab your new everyday set um, and then I could show you the website So this is the website, seamless sets, only $15. And then it just, this is the um, desktop version. Then it has a picture of both of the sets. The mobile version just has this part. Um, it doesn't have like the side other pictures of the sets. And then $15 seamless sets. So it has the sets there. Um, so they're 50% off. And then the rest of the website is the same. Uh, I really just changed the top part. So this is what it is looking like. So again, if you guys are looking for some sets, um, our seamless sets are only $15 this week only. This vlog is going up Tuesday, I believe. I think I'm going to try to edit it tonight. So be ready for Tuesday. So you guys still have time to shop the sale. Um, or if you know anybody that's looking for a seamless set, um, the sets go small, medium, large. And they are like, um, they're stretchy, but they are like fitted. So um, I would say they could possibly stretch to like one size up, but just know they're going to be fitted. So if you are large, you um, if you're extra large and you get the large, it's going to be fitted. Like you'll still be able to fit it, but it you'll still be able to fit it, but it's going to be fitted. <laughs> I hope that makes sense. Um, it's not like a loose set. Um, it's a more fitted set. Uh, if you are looking for a loose set, we do have our um, mineral wash, biker wash set. I think I only have a size extra large left in that though. But anyways... So yeah, they um they come in black and they also come in nude. And this set is perfect for, like I said, like everyday wear, lounging around, running errands. You can wear it to work out. Um, you can just wear it lounging around, running errands, coffee dates, whatever you want to do. Um, and it's still like we have about, like I said, about a month and a half left of being warm, depending on where you live. Um, but even when it does start to get chilly, you could easily layer on like a cardigan or layer on a um, blazer or layer on a, um, what is it? Layer on a, what else am I thinking of? 
layer on a blazer or layer on oh a flannel or like a um, button up because I think we have it layered with like a button up on the website so it's perfect piece for like layering for um I know soon it's gonna start getting it's still gonna be hot in the day but then chilly at night so you can wear the set and then just throw on a flannel at night if you're running around in it but yes just overall a good set so I will leave the link to my website in the description box if you are interested or you know somebody like I said that's looking for a set send them my way um, I'm going to be sending out, let me see which day, look at my calendar. Oh, okay, on Wednesday, so that'll be tomorrow for this vlog, I'm going to be sending out um, an email about five ways that you can style this seamless set for now and as we transition into fall. So make sure you guys are on the email list, especially if you're kind of like on the fence and you're like, oh, summer's supposed to be over, but you can always wear it next summer. Like it's a seamless set. That's the perfect, that's the whole reason behind the style district is to be able to have pieces that can be styled from season to season or from year to year like it's not like super trendy where you can only wear it now like you can buy it now for $15 wear it for the next month and a half two months depending on where you live or if you live like in Miami you can wear it all year um and then it'll be perfect for next year as well um because it's like great quality um and yeah that's that's about it so I'm just gonna end the vlog off here hope you guys enjoyed this small business vlog and I will see y'all in my next vlog peace out